What's up, everybody? It's the blonde beard of Shell Z. That's me, y'all. Ha <laughs> ha, that's me. Look, haven't made a cake in a while. So I thought about it. I say, let me make me a banana foster cake. So banana foster, you got bananas. You got rum, you got um, 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 brown sugar, you got butter. Um, usually you cook it, you put it over ice cream, but we're going to put it on a cake. And it's going to be just as good as the dessert that you get in New Orleans. All right, let's get these ingredients together. All right, y'all. <laughs> All right, we're going to make the banana foster filling first. So I have my skillet up here on medium. We'll call these ingredients out. I have in my description box on YouTube. So we're about to put in one fourth cup of butter, which is a half a stick. Okay, and let that melt down. Put your pan on medium heat. Put it on medium. And get that butter melted down. After you get that butter melted down, put in one fourth cup of brown sugar at, with one teaspoon of cinnamon. So that's what's in there. Just put that in there. All right. Now that that brown sugar and cinnamon is in there. This is four ripe bananas that's cut in about an inch. Okay. And the bananas. Um, we're gonna let these bananas cook for about um about two to three minutes. Then we'll add the vanilla extract and the rum. I'm not doing no flambe, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do a flambe. I'm not gonna light it on fire because of course I'm in the house by myself and I don't wanna set that no fire. So let this cook down for about three minutes. Alright, yes, it's been about three minutes. Since this is electric, I'm going to take it and put it on this aisle right here. Okay. Now, I'm going to put about a teaspoon of vanilla extract. Okay. And I'm about to put two ounces of um, dark rum. Okay. Now, if I was to do a flambe, I would light it right now. But like I say, I'm not, nobody's in the house with me but me. So I'm gonna put it back on this aisle right here. Go like this. And I'm going to turn the fire up. And I'm going to let this alcohol, I'm gonna let this rum cook off. Next time I do it, I'll light a fire for y'all. So let it come back to a heat. And we're going to let it reduce. After we let it reduce, I'm going to um, drain the liquid from the bananas. And we're going to use that liquid to be our glaze to go on top of our cake. All right. Okay, it's been cooking for about five minutes. i just been going like that. Okay, you can go and take it and put it to the side. The banana foster is done. Now I'm gonna strain that liquid off from the bananas. That's working out with cake. The bananas go go into the cake and the juice of this is gonna be mixed with some um, pot of sugar to make the glaze. All right, let's get busy with the cake. All right, let's start our, our cake. Right here, that's two sticks of softened butter, which is one cup. And there we're going to put three cups of granul granulated sugar. And we're going to mix and cream this for about five minutes. All right. All right. It's been about six minutes. See, it's light and fluffy. 
Now you need six large eggs. You're gonna put in one egg at a time. I got them all in this bowl, so if I put two in there at a time, it don't matter. So let me, there we go. I heard two yolks fall, so that's two. Okay, we're gonna beat these eggs in here. All right, y'all, after that's mixed up, let me show you how fluffy that is. See how good and fluffy that is with the eggs in there now? All right, let's scrape these sides down. Okay. Okay. All right, here I have a half a cup of sour cream and a half a cup of um, um, buttermilk. So I want to, um. Let me go and incorporate this all together. I can incorporate that buttermilk into that sour cream. And just make it one mixture. All right, let me incorporate this together. All right, my dry ingredients right here. I have three cups of flour, a half a teaspoon of kosher salt, one teaspoon of baking powder, and a half a teaspoon of baking soda. So, I'm about to put half of the dry in, and we're going to alternate it. Okay, that's half the dry. Turn on my mixer. Let's put half of this mixture up in here. All right. So we're going to do two increments of that. And I'll be back. Okay, all that's combined. Let's put a teaspoon and a half of pure vanilla extract. I'm using Mexican. Okay. Right there. Okay, let's mix this in. All right, we got everything mixed up. Now, let's make it banana foster. Remember those um, bananas that we cooked? Put that in the batter. You fold that in there. I got my oven set at 350. We're gonna put this cake, this cake in there for about um. We're gonna put this cake in here for about an hour, hour fifteen minutes, and let's add some pecans in there. That's about a um, half a cup to a cup. All right. Take your spatula and just fold it in. This is your banana foster pound cake. Yeah. Now you want to make a banana foster, you get just vanilla, you get just some vanilla ice cream, put it on it, put it in a bowl. You cook that mixture that I cooked and you pour it over the bananas. Right? Like I say, you put a flame to it. After you put the alcohol in it, you set it a fire. When the fire died down, from the fire hitting the um the rum, when the fire burn out, which means the alcohol has cooked out of the rum, you take it and you pour it over the ice cream. Yeah. Look up Banana Foster. It's a Louisiana thing. By, made by, I think, Mr. Paul Prudham, I think. Uh, serve it at Brennan's in New Orleans. Yeah. It's made for a guy named Richard Foster, 1951. Yeah. All right, that's it. Let's get our pan together. All right, we're gonna use the cute uh, pan right here, bunt cake pan that's made like the but like a, um, a crown. Okay, so I got it floured. I got it greased up, or you can cook, or you can use um cooking spray, um, baking spray. I got my oven on 325. All right. So y'all know me, I'll take it. And I'm gonna scoop me some in here. Be right back.
Okay, so we had enough batter to actually make two. So we're gonna put this one in there, just a little cute um, butt pan. It's gonna like a crown. And I got my little small tool pan here. That was the remainder of the batter. All right, I'm gonna put them in the oven for an hour and five minutes. And then we're gonna check on it. So Alexa, set timer for 65 minutes. One hour and five minutes, starting now. All right, y'all, be right back. All right, got cake number one out. Then get the second one. I think they are ready. We're going to test and see. See that? All right, let me put my toothpick. Let's get the toothpick test. Okay, put it in right there. Stick it in. All right. Can't come back clean. Now, take my hand, fill this one. All right. They ready, y'all? There you go. We're going to turn them over in five minutes. You know the first one, y'all. Just flipped it over. Don't that look good? Show y'all. Look how pretty that one is. That's the one that was made in the two pan. Okay. Let's set that to the side. Now, let's get this pretty baby out right here. That pan is yeah, still hot, but we're going to flip this on the board. This the one, this one here. My little niece going to take it to work um, for her co-workers. So this is the banana foster pound cake. So let me take it and uh, like this. Let's see. Like this. And I want to look it like that. Make sure it's on the this thing is hot. Hot, hot, hot. Okay. So can I lift it up? Come on, lift up for me. Um I'm gonna lift up. <clears throat> Hold on one second, y'all. These gloves won't let me lift it up. Okay, I had to get my other bit into the grips on it. Now let me lift it up. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Okay, uh, there we go, y'all. There it goes. Look how pretty that is. Y'all see that? Y'all see? There we go. And that go to mmm mmm when I say smell so good, smell like banana nut bread. Now let's make the frosting the icing that go on top. Look how pretty that is. Look at that. Look at that, look at that, look at that. Alright. Y'all see that? Alright. Let's make the glaze. Okay, to make this glaze, okay. Remember we had a little leftover of the uh syrup. On a little leftover bananas from the um, banana foster. So in there, you're going to put, this is one cup of confectioner sugar. And let's put a, about another, uh, let's see, about another um, third of a cup. Yeah. Okay. We're just doing, we're just doing a rough estimate. Okay, here go my whisk right here. So I'm whisking that in. Okay. Also, so let me add in. Let me add about a cap full of rum. Of um, this is the rum that we use. So this is a cap full, maybe a teaspoon of um. There we go. A teaspoon of spice rum. Let's put in. About a half a teaspoon 
a vanilla extract. There. And let's put in about a, a teaspoon right now of heavy whipping cream. About right there. Now, if it's too loose, we'll just add some more powdered sugar to it. So let's whisk this together. Let's whisk this till it gets smooth. Okay. Got my little bitty wrist. So we're gonna whisk to make sure we don't have no clumps in this. And I'm throwing powdered sugar everywhere. All right, let me whisk. Okay, I added about two more teaspoons of heavy whipping cream and one more teaspoon of um, spice rum. And there we go. This is the consistency that I want. See there? Look at that. All right, now let me give it a get my spoon right here and give it a taste. Let's see here. Mm. Mm. That's it. That is it. I taste the rum. I taste the vanilla. I taste the banana. All right, let's put it on the cake. All right, it's cake time, y'all. It's cake time. Let me take my glasses off. I don't need that on the eat. <laughs> and it's still warm. I love cake when it's still warm. And y'all know what I got? Gotta have me a glass of milk. Mm. Mm. Clear my palate first. All right. Y'all seen this banana foster pound cake? Cake, whatever. Mm -hmm. Let me tell y'all something. I don't just be saying mmm because -hmm, I made it. The stuff be good. It be good. Mm -hmm. Y'all gotta make this cake. I found this recipe somewhere on New York Times. I'm gonna put the recipe in the description box. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. No, like warm cake and cold milk. Mm. And bananas at that. Mm -mm -mm. All right. Y'all seen the blind <laughs> British chef make it? Gonna make it one. I guarantee you, you're going to enjoy it. <laughs> Bye, y'all. <laughs>